if you understand stromonium by the general idea of what a lot of our homeopaths generally give in all materia medica stromonium is given as a remedy for mania for insanity for delirium but today i am also going to give you an idea how you can just by the way of patient expression the way of his talking how he behaves how he doesn't behave how you can come to stromoni all parts of stromonium have alkaloids of atropine hyoscyamine scopolamine and these are often many many delirians and and anticholinergics also called as datura stromonium called as datura stromonium datura intoxication causes delirium hallucinations tachycardia bizarre behavior urinary retention midriasis photophobia and so on historically in many places stromonium was used for its hallucinogenic properties datura has its origin in india also where a sister species of stromonium datura methyl was considered sacred believed to be favorite of the great lord of uh, india of hinduism shiva so many many saints they would use this typically along with cannabis along with aconitum ferox for different experiences for liberation for moksha for spirituality so it's interesting it's interesting to understand this in context one of the main primary active agents in datura is atropine is very interesting here the chinese also have used it in form of anesthesia what is the main thing for me for stromonium the main feeling the main feel let's come back so very interesting rubric i want to i want to explain you this this is a very important thing what i am telling trying to tell you if you understand this you will understand entire remedy so look at this rubric delusion dogs attack him delusion dogs biting and tearing flesh off his chest delusion dog large what does this mean first of all remember it's a delusion it's not the truth so so stremonium the patient stremonium even if he looks at rat even if we look at mice even if he sees a small injection even if he sees a needle even if he sees little water their imagination goes as if they feel the experience as if the dog is coming and biting his chest off this is the experience of smallest of things for them if a dog comes and bites your chest off you are obviously going to be very scared and run the hell out of here but if it's not a dog if it's a small mice if it's a small insect it's just an ant but you start reacting or you start imagining it or you start experiencing it as if the dog is coming and biting that screw up out of your chest this is the state of stromonium this is a very important experience i want you to remember every time you think about stromonium in your life you have to think that the that the patient of stromonium is starting to imagine his or her whole life as if someone is coming and just biting the chest off remember plain jan this is stromonium a little deeper let's go a little deeper so what is the reaction of of stromonium what is the reaction the reaction is 
कॉल द डॉक्टर कॉल द डॉक्टर कॉल द डॉक्टर 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 प्लीज हेल्प मी हेल्प मी हेल्प मी और ही विल कॉल हिज मदर ममा ममा प्लीज हेल्प मी हेल्प मी हेल्प मी वाई ममा बिकॉज इन दिस स्टेट ऑफ फियर द स्ट्रमोनियम ऑलमोस्ट बिहेव लाइक अ चाइल्ड देर इज नो मेच्योरिटी देर इज नो ब्रेन इन्वॉल्व यूर देर इज नो इंटेलेक्चुअलनेस इन्वॉल्व यूर स्ट्रमोनियम goes at an impulsive level because for the first time stremonium in a state of lot of stress starts reacting with flight fright reactions it's almost his sympathetic nervous system takes charge of his life so for him the only way out is either run away that is escape escape the situation of life or clinging they cling please help so look at this rubric clinging children awakened terrified knows no one scream to those near him understand this very beautiful rubric a patient comes and tells you doctor 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 i did a sonography it shows it shows there is there is ulcer ulcer in the stomach <laughs> what will happen what will happen now i don't know what to do so i saw your name there written dr goran so i came i came please help me please help me please help me i know only you can help me please help me please help me i don't know anyone and uh, you, you you tell me whatever you do i i i i i i will do it so what does this whole phenomena mean clinging first of all the patient is clinging to the doctor only you can help me number 2 clinging children which means a 40 year old adult start behaving like a children awakens terrified knows no one it is as if he knows no one <laughs> i know no one uh, where am i oh no i don't know what is this ulcer what is going to happen knows no one screams help me help me help me this is the whole state of stress clinging take hand or part of mother why mother it doesn't actually directly mean a mother it could also mean mother like figure mother like figure could be a doctor could be a friend it could be anyone who gives unconditioned love so the feeling clinging clinging doctor doctor please help me help me help me stremonium please gentlemen are you all with me are you getting this this patient's experiences i am trying to tell you from different different clinical experiences just a very interesting rubric and that's one of the main rubrics for me to understand stremonium from the mind section you should remember this very beautifully delusion alone in wilderness this is a very important kind of state of stremonium where this patient of stremonium starts feeling starts thinking as if as if he's alone he's alone he's alone in wilderness wilderness is jungle so the whole feeling for stremonium is as if i am alone i am alone in the jungle i can be attacked from anywhere so the patient will often come and tell you doctor 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 you you are homeopathy doctor you i know you will treat me i don't want to go to hospital i don't want to once i go in hospital they put injection they will put iv line one doctor will come will tell me something another doctor then another doctor will come they will tell me do this can that can this that 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 uh, no 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 i will i am totally alone i know no one i will be totally alone everyone will attack me delusion alone in wilderness so interesting constant sleeping they will scream scream for help children children the stramonium children are the best very beautiful they will come inside you know typical stramonium i had a stramonium case the child will come inside he will look at you huh because you know the child has taken so many vaccinations that he remembers that every time he goes to a clinic he meet a doctor he knows he is going to get an injection so suddenly the patient the child the stramonium child remembers the injection the pain the injury <laughs> this man is going to give me injection again 
uh, uh, and he starts screaming he tells mo his mother and father uh, uh, let's go let's go let's go let's go from here let's go from here uh, and the, he the stramonium child will take the hand of of mother and father and he will pull pull let's go let's go let's go let's go stramonium plain gen this is stramonium you don't have to ask questions to stramonium child you will just see and you will know this is stramonium very interesting rubric what is the main feeling of stramonium look at this rubric see how they experience stramonium is not only scared of death how do they look at death you ask them he will say i am scared of dying what do you mean dying for stramonium dying is not like just dying for stramonium the whole imagination of death how does he perceive death as is a very beautiful rubric you can see delusion murdered killed roast and eaten so the whole feeling is as if someone will come and basically roast you and eat you up this is the whole experience of stramonium can you imagine can you imagine how stramonium looks at life anything 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 which is different they feel hurry huh murdered killed roasted and eaten can you imagine this rubric can you imagine how stramonium must be looking at life so interesting stramonium patient will come and tell you doctor yesterday night i went to my friend's wedding and today morning i ate i got up i started getting so much pain in the abdomen something very strange i i will i have to do some x ray or some some sonography or some investigation will i have to do something this is so strange i have never experienced this before this is i have never experienced i think this is something different you don't think this is something very different no some big illness you don't think this is some very big illness no you you don't think this 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 burning is not some that 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 illness that 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 illness you think this is how stramonium looks at them everything you know they are very scared of anything new and strange that's a very important state of stramonium so very important rubric for stramonium is have a look at this delusion everything is strange delusion familiar things are strange delusion friends are strange delusion see strangers it's the strange thing everything was normal what is this this is are this is strange this i never felt before strange strange very important group with of them strange let's go further what is it that stramonium wants what is it that they long for kent has written beautifully the main thing for stramonium is sunshine they want sunshine they want the light they can't take darkness and they want society they want people they want to talk they can't be alone stramonium is happiest in the day time or at night when the light is on or when he has people in or around if he is alone he is gone
Kappan, Bogart, Synoptic, Key, let's see. My favorite materia medica. So stramonium has a lot of action on brain and that's why stramonium is a very important remedy for brain related problems. And that's why stramonium I also use in many autism cases, ADHD cases, behavioral disorder, psychiatric disorders, action on circulation throat, circulation skin, spinal nerves, arms, hip, left hip joint. Herring has written about this. Spinal nerves, genital. So this is the whole sphere of action. Worse by glistening objects, bright thing, fright. Worse after sleep, like lachesis. Worse by dark cloudy days. Why dark? Because they are scared of dark. Worse by suppression. Any, they are getting cough or urine. And due to allopathic medicine, it's suppressed. They will start getting convulsions. Better by light. Better by company and warmth. This is typical for Stremony. What has Boga written very nicely? A remedy for terrors, but lacking in pain. So it is one of the remedies which is painlessness. They are very scared and there is not much pain. Suppressed symptoms, suppressed discharges. Passing neither urine nor stool. So retention of urine, retention of stool with lot of fear. Something they see, something scary, and then they just cannot pass stool, cannot pass urine. Urine becomes retention, paralysis of bladder. Think about stramonium. Very important for neurological cases, involuntary movement, convulsions, rhythmic, graceful movement, stramonium. Korea, stramonium. Wildly excited, night terror. Suddenly, at she's sleeping at night. Suddenly, she'll scream. Stramonium. Sometimes they can become very stupid. Sometimes, at a later stage of stramonium, they might get imbecile. Fix sparkling stare. They will stare for a long time like this. They may develop squint. They are very scared of black. The black color reminds them of terror. That is the thing. That's why stramonium, because of so much of fears in their childhood, develop a lot of symptoms like stammering, like spasms, involuntary jerking, convulsions, after fear. Remember, very scared childhood, very terrible childhood, very abused childhood with so much of fear may require stramonium. If you are give, if the child gets stramonium at that age, at a later stage, he will not develop pathological symptoms. Frowning, like lycopodium, frowning. But frowning is because of fear of stramonium. Painless, involuntary diarrhea. That's why very important for IBS, irritable bowel syndrome. Nymphomania. But not as shameless as hyosamus. Non-appearing exanthema. Eruption doesn't appear, but start developing neurological symptoms because immunity is very low. Unilateral paralysis with twitching. So one side is twitching, another side is paralysis. Stroke patient, apoplexy. Crawling as of many bugs. So many neurological symptoms. This is Lane Genman's stramonium. So interesting. I think very beautifully. The best thing you can do after today's talk is go and read Kent Materia Medica, Stramonium. And so beautifully, only first line of Kent, when considering Stramonium, the idea of violence come into one mind. So amazing. Kent really was a romantic writer of homeopathy. If, if you are wanting to do romance with Materia Medicas, read Kent. So beautiful. Now, I think I can probably, just before I finish, I'm going to take some question and answers. But what is the homework for today? First, you write to me right now. What did you learn today about Stramonium? Number one, you write to me. You have my email ID, all of you. Number two, you have to read 
Stramonium, Hyoscyamus, and Belladonna from all the books. You have to read from Kent Repertory. You have to read from Allen's. You have to read from Clark. You have to read from N. M. Chaudhary. You have to read from Dr. Sankar and Soul of Remedy. Everything. And once you read it, then you make a table. How to differentiate all these references? This is your homework for today.